fellow cyborgs, and welcome to another comic book review. Today, I would like to talk with you about some manga, actually. I tiptoed into the manga world when I was 15 and wanted to be cool and spent way too much money on some volumes and then just kind of dropped out. But maybe five years ago, my friend pointed this out at the local library and I checked it out and ended up checking it out from the library twice before I bought myself a copy because it was just so sweet and adorable, short and succinct, and just ugh, my epitome of a lovely manga. And I am talking about the complete drama con by Svetlana Chimkova. So this manga is only three volumes long and you can find it bound in the DramaCon Ultimate Edition as I have here. If you're going to read it, I highly recommend you find the bound edition because there's an extra bonus feature chapter at the back, which really I think helps close the story better than just the end of volume three might have. So DramaCon is a manga about Christy, our main characters, first and then subsequent experiences at a comic convention. She is a manga writer herself, aspiring manga writer. I think she's only 16 when the first volume comes out. And she's visiting the con with her boyfriend and two other friends and they have a table. Her boyfriend ends up being a complete jerk face and she ends up running away from the table in tears and bumps right into Shades McHot Guy and questions about her relationship with her boyfriend and Sue. This is so great. I love reading this because it's just like my, my dream experiences at a, at a con, which hasn't happened yet because normally when I go to conventions, I'm just like deer in the headlights, so much stimulation after three hours, I'm pooped and need an introvert nap. And I really wish that my experiences were more like hers because she just has so much fun and meets people and just, oh, this is so cute. Very romantic and very sweet. And there are, of course, miscommunications and misunderstandings, but it all works out in the end. Each volume takes place over the duration of a con. And so volume one is the first year, she goes back for a second year and a third year. And things pick up right where they left off at the con. And you get to meet a whole cast of characters who are very fun and drama ensues. But it's not frivolous drama, or when it is, it knows it's being frivolous, and chances are there's use of chibis in the illustrations, which I think are just very, very appropriate. This does, however, touch on some very important, serious topics, and it handles it really, really well, which is fantastic. In between topics like my parents don't support me wanting to be an artist, but this is what I want to do, or violence within a relationship. So in, interspersed between those serious topics, which are really well done, you get chibi, pocky hordes, and all sorts of con shenanigans. This is my favorite manga, mostly because I am not a prolific manga reader, and also because I can read this in a day and it's done. It's not a long running series that I need three weeks to get through. So if you haven't yet tried Drama Con, please pick it up. I love it every single time that I read it. I reread it quite often whenever I'm feeling nostalgic for cons and want to slip into my con dream world, which is encapsulated by what happens in Drama Con. If you're going to a convention yourself sometime soon, I also recommend picking this up just to get you extra excited for the experience. I hope you enjoyed that introduction to Svetlana Chimkova's Drama Con. I hope you get a chance to pick it up. Please leave me in the comments down below if you have any other manga suggestions for me. I love to hear your recommendations and let me know if you've read this and what you thought. I hope you read yourself some adorable manga and until next time, continue to be lovely.